Congratulations, Steve. You did wonderful. <laughs> and now, let's see who has been chosen to move one step closer to the title of Miss Universe 2019. The first semi-finalist from this region is... South Africa. Well, how are you? I'm good, Steve. How are you? Good. I'm, I'm wonderful. Here's your question. Uh, you start out each day by singing very loudly. What's been your go-to song this week? You know, Steve, to pay off my singing, I like to self-affirm every morning. I look at myself in the mirror and I say, you're beautiful, you're capable, and you're intelligent. So this week I was listening to Brown Skin Girl just to activate that black girl magic. Yes. Thank you, South Africa. Thank you, Steve. South Africa. My parents are very big on education. And so when I got financially excluded from school, that meant that I could not continue with my studies. A huge percentage of South African students were drowning in student loans and most of us were kicked out of school. So I felt like a huge part of me was being taken away. But when one door closes, you know, another door opens. After being out of school for a year, I was able to learn a lot of things about myself, but also through Miss South Africa and through modeling, I was able to go back to school again and graduate. South Africa. Starting with South Africa. I got my first book ever from my grandmother who never got an opportunity to get an education. She gave me that book because she had hoped that I would have a future much better than hers. I come from strong women who have fought not only to be recognized as humans, but to be recognized as intelligent and capable leaders. Because of those women, I am here today, and it is now my responsibility to inspire others, to lead, to be the best, and to stay confident in everything that they do. Thank you so much. Africa. Every morning when I get up, I blast my music and sing at the top of my lungs. It makes me feel free, and when I'm free, I'm my most powerful. My dress symbolizes where I come from. It represents the brown of the sand and the blue of the ocean. I feel like I have South Africa with me on the stage. Peru! The chance at Miss Universe is Mexico. Mexico. She will be joined by South Africa. Alright, here we go, Sam Africa. Here is your question. What is the most important thing we should be teaching young girls today? I think the most important thing we should be teaching young girls today is leadership. It's something that has been lacking in young girls and women for a very long time, not because we don't want to, but because of what society has labeled women to be. I think we are the most powerful beings in the world, and that we should be given every opportunity 
and that is what we should be teaching these young girls to take up space. Nothing as important as taking up space in society and cementing yourself. Thank you, South Africa. Very good. All right. South Africa. in a world where a woman who looks like me, with my kind of skin and my kind of hair, was never considered to be beautiful. And I think that it is time that that stops today. I want children to look at me and see my face, and I want them to see their faces reflected in mine. Thank you. Now we are down to South Africa and Puerto Rico. Only one of you can be crowned our new Miss Universe. If for any reason the winner is unable to fulfill her duties, the first runner-up will take her place. Good luck to you both. The new Miss Universe is... South Africa!
Thank you. 